Hello Capricorn and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of August 19th and this is a quick general and intuitive reading. Okay, so fate, <clears throat> destiny, boy, that's been showing up a lot since the summer for a lot of um, readings that I've seen. Um, so experiences that you go through this week are faded. Okay, so I do feel that energy as well. I am seeing here um, as above, so below. Okay, so definitely seeing that kind of energy. This is um, also a yes answer to maybe something you've been wanting to do or what you need is there within reach. So I do feel that energy as well. Um, this is a time where you're drawing in energy to you. So your thoughts could become things. And also that means positive or negative. So be careful of your, of what you're drawing into you. So you're kind of like calling things out in a way. Okay. So I do see that energy. It is a general reading though. Um, this is a week that I see also, you could be dealing with a cancer or someone who exhibits those energies. Um, counting your blessings is very important this week and you have a lot of help and spiritual help around you. It's important to meditate this week, contemplate a little as well and reevaluate some things. Okay. Um, you may be dropping some opportunities or, um, these are missed opportunities, but this is because it's not on your time. So I'm seeing that for some of you as well. Your next new beginning is going to be significant. There's going to be some big changes, and that is coming up maybe mid-September um, to October is what I'm seeing here. That is showing up approximately. Um, I do see here, okay, someone who has a question out there, the answer is yes. Um, you're coming into your power. You're getting things under control. You're taking back your power. I do see here some of you may be feeling very alone. Um, maybe it's um, you're reassessing should you be in a relationship. If you're, not, if you're not in a relationship or even if you are in one, you could just feel lonely. There is, you know, it's, it's brief and passing. So I see that energy. Um, one step at a time, do one thing at a time here. Because if you do uh, bite off more than you can chew or you go from one thing to another or you don't let something finish, then you're going to have to go re back, go back and uh, retract and redo. So I do see that energy as well. Have patience and tolerance with someone. Okay, this is someone in your inner circle as well. Um, and um, see how things pan out first before you make any choices and decisions is what I'm seeing. I do see you could be also dealing with a Sagittarius or someone who exhibits those energies. And be careful, this person could be taking advantage of you somehow. Okay, they're using you somehow too. I do see also these changes, something that is going to be coming into, like I said, maybe October, all the way going into December is going to be significant. There's going to be like a good deal coming in or something good with business, especially if you're a business owner or with work. So I'm seeing that kind of energy as well. Um, message may be coming in, okay? Other people may not be on the same time length with you. So it's like maybe you want to do something and they're like, no, 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 no. But they'll finally catch up. They will be um, kind of um, on the same page eventually. I do see that. Slow and steady wins the race this week. Like I said, do not bite off more than you can chew. Okay? Because if you do, this adds extra responsibilities and a burden on your back. Um, keeping some thoughts and opinions to yourself and also... Um, your money, but also this, like I said, don't make assumptions or just see how something turns out before you make a decision. I do see abundance around you too. So that's looking good for some of you. This is unexpected expenditures though. This could be something maybe that you forgot to pay a bill or something comes up more expensive. I would watch the spending, maybe something that's not worth it at the end. So I do see that kind of energy too. I do see here could have, would have, should have. So this could be buyer's remorse. So that's a possibility as well. So I'm seeing that energy. I do see the door is opening to love and romance in your life as well. And there is a female here who it, who is very caring and very much supports and loves you. Okay, definitely in the background. And maybe some of you don't even realize it or you don't feel it. Okay, that could be a family member. That could be a friend, um, anyone. So I'm just seeing that kind of energy showing up as well. This is a week of slow and steady definitely wins the race. Communication is so powerful. Um, your thoughts could become things too. So I see that high creativity and definitely um, 
slow and steady, you know, it's like building some things that just start starting to build and they're going to show you, you're going to reap the rewards or you're going to see the, um, end results. Like, like I said, something October and then going into December, um, the numbers 33, 44 are coming up strong and four for this week. Okay. All right. Well, Capricorn, that is your reading for the week of August 19th. Have a fabulous week and bye for now.